Welcome to StraightUpLearning.com. To insert page numbering in Microsoft Word, you can navigate over to your Insert Menu tab. And from your Insert Menu tab, we're going to navigate to the Header and Footer ribbon. And we're going to look at, at the Page Number feature, and we're going to click on the drop-down arrow right next to it. So as we click on that drop-down arrow, we're presented with a number of options which pertain to the placement of our page into number. We're going to choose the bottom of page option, and as we do, we'll notice that another screen will appear giving us some examples of how our page numbers will appear. We can either choose to take plane number one, which will have the page number more to the left, or plane number two, which the page number is then centered on the page, or plane number three, where the page number is towards the right. For training purposes, we're going to select the middle option, which is plane number two. Once we select the page number, Microsoft Word will automatically place you within the footer option. Page numbers are placed within the footer. This way, you can see the page numbers on each page. Once you're in the footer option, your menu will change to reflect the header and footer tools. From the header and footer, and footer, footer tools menu, 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 we can come over here to the header, header, header and footer ribbon, and we can once again click on page number and take a look at how to change a page number. So we can come over here to format page numbers, and we'll be presented with the page number format screen. By using the number format option, we can click on the drop down arrow and select a different format for our page number. So we can have our page number appear here in alphabetical, such as ABC, and we can even have some Roman numerals here, such as the lowercase i and the uppercase i. For training purposes, we're just going to click out of here and leave this page number just as the regular number format of 123. We can also come down here to where it says page numbering, and if we were using section breaks, we can actually let it continue from a previous section, or we can come over here and change how our page number will start. So let's say we wanted it to start at page number 5. We can click in here and just type in the number 5. We can also use our spindle arrow keys to navigate it up and down. For training purposes, we're going to change this and leave this at number 1 and merely just hit OK. So we still have our page number one and our footer um, option. To remove a page number from the header and click on the drop down and choose, choose, choose the option to remove page numbers. Once you do, the page number will disappear from the footer. To close out of your header and footer menu toolbar, we can come up here to the ribbon and choose close header and footer. Thank you for attending. For additional courses, visit straightuplearning.com or contact us at 704-909-6139.